Hello and welcome to a tech video for Windows 10. Usually I don't make these videos that often, but I wanted to share this little awesome program now for people who are on Windows 10 or at least considering but maybe have some concerns about privacy. Um, if you go to the search bar and you type in let's say private oh I can't even spell it. <laughs> sorry so if you go in and type privacy you're gonna find that option here and there's all these different things that you can turn off as you can see every tab here is almost turned off like there are few that maybe needs to be manually shut off uh, but most of the things they will not at all be turned on now how did I do this make it fast you know snappy don't waste time on it. Um, yeah, I think that was all the options. So how did I do this? Well, I used the SpyBot. So SpyBot is a firm that makes, well, software. That could be a lot of things they make. But I'm only interested in the anti-beacon, which the program is called. I have a link in the description below for this one, and you can just download it. And as soon as you download it, which takes half a minute, you're gonna get this tiny little executable program here and the program itself is just this so there's a frequently asked one which is always nice uh, you know it's sincere, it's affordable, we are comprehensive, it's flexible, it's user friendly I want to talk a bit about the user friendliness I don't want to have to install like 10 different programs and have to do like 2 hours of looking around for shit, I just want something that works fast and this one does work fast as soon as you install it, you go in here to protection, the first tab and then you just click immunize and then the program is gonna say full protection is in place and that is all you need to do there is also an optional tab here um, this one is a little more advanced if you're not quite sure about this, you should maybe just skip this one but it's basically also more about privacy, uh, privacy such as uh, well you can say something like here Bing IPs if you use Bing you might not want to disable this one if you use uh, OneDrive group, group policy OneDrive service maybe you don't want to uh, put those in as well um, that's kinda up to yourself you have to know a little about your computer and your own needs to do the optional tab but for the most part you're just gonna be having the uh, main tab here and then as soon as you click minimize that's all you need to do and you're done and now Windows 10 cannot spy on you that is at least the theory I hope that the, the program really is foolproof um, after updates you might need to click the minimize button again once in a while but that's pretty much it now I also want to talk a little about privacy I'm not a tinfoil hat kinda guy but recently there was some post uh, from the official uh, whatever Microsoft uh, workers they said that they had collected different kinds of data so that is data for how many people who have installed uh, Windows 10 and so on but some of the data was really comprehensive they knew that how many people have used certain aspects of the uh, system itself and I don't really like that that they know that say one million people use that specific thing in Windows 10 that is a little too much uh, for me personally but um, yeah I think I want to end the video with that uh, no tinfoil hat <laughs> just spreading the good word of the NCB current for Windows 10 goodbye